Hi, this is Kishim. I'm going to present Angular project, which has been hosted in Amazon Web Service S3 bucket, and the backend has been hosted in the AWS EC2. And technology we used uh, AWS S3, AWS EC2. Um, <clears throat> we used the Docker container, Jenkins, um, GitHub version control, Maven. Spring Boot, TypeScript, uh, Node, um, JavaScript, HTML, CSS, Bootstrap, and uh, PostgreSQL database. Okay, so I ran the server already. So <clears throat> this is the VS tools I used to uh, create the Angular project. Right, let's see the demo. Um, okay, bug out. So this is the front page look like. So I'm gonna log in. Okay, so we have the task ID <clears throat> and it's I uh, have completed yes or no, right? Completed or not, and the create creation date and I have update and deletion. That's under home base. Alright. Let's see um how if with the delete. So click delete, it deleted. If I want to update this project, uh, the title name, whatever the project name, the task name, I'm going to say demo, shit, demo task one or two, one. Okay, so this was not completed, so it's false. But if I say it's completed, click here, true. Okay, update. So this was comp when it's completed, then it <coughs> it decorated like this, uncompleted. So I say it's completed. All right, so that's update. We can delete. All right. So now after I delete, uh, so the demo task one, the ID is 29. It's not exist anymore in the database. So if I click the update here it will fail because this update uh, the data is not exist update fail right so um so you have update delete so let's see the source uh, source i implemented implemented um with the task id right 28 you can search by ID, search by title, you can search by date, 2020 These are all the tasks created on 26. Okay. Also, you can search by true or false. True means completed, false means not completed. Okay. Okay, now let's create a, a new task. Right, so the task name should go here. Demo task 4. And the date uh, is going to be... Zero nine and let's say zero nine again twenty twenty and then I say it is not completed so false submit so task four is right here I just create that and if I update that is if I say okay it's for, uh, 
completed so it's completed okay so the so this is done log out um this one is running from a local machine all right and then i'm gonna show my s3 bucket so this is my s3 bucket um this is our all the uh, angular application here and and ec2 i only have one ec2 instance uh, that is holding the backing api uh, for my uh, task uh, force project okay for this project i implemented continuous uh, deployment and con or continuous uh, integration so anytime we uh, push the code in the github repo uh, it automatically update uh, in the amazon web services uh, ec2 um, and uh, amazon aws uh, s3 bucket okay so mm, uh, this is all uh, thank you very much for watching this video